Man, this dude, Kenneth in the building. This dude, back in 2015, was it 2015 or 2014? I, I can't remember, but yeah, back, one, of, one, of one, one of the two, came, came out, got our CDL, got, got your CDLs. Unfortunately, yeah. you didn't finish up at Tri-C. You went to Swift to finish Swift. To finish up your CDL, you got yeah. your CDL, right? And several what what three two three years later, you you went down to Atlanta, some somewhere around between then and now. You you went you went and got your barber license, and then you went down right. to Atlanta, bro. Right. What, what's the story, my G? Start start from the beginning. Introduce yourself, my G. All right. Well, my name is Ken, a.k.a. Max the Barber. Max? Call me Max for short. Max. You say Mac or Max? Max. Max the Barber. Yeah. Okay. Max the Barber. Okay. Okay. It's like, it's like Sean said. And in 2014, 15, somewhere there, mm -hmm. in the, uh in a tri C. Right. I got my CDL and I did it to uh, about three or four years. Uh going strong too. Everything else right there. All right, so hold uh, hold up, hold up, hold up right there. Hold up. What did you be before you even went to trucking school? What what you was doing beforehand? Oh, I was a chef. Oh, chef. Uh, like, wait, we, we talking about gourmet meals type chef? Yeah. Right there. We, we talking about five star restaurants type chef? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, so, right in the kitchen, man. so we went from five star. Like, what was what was some of the what, what was some of the good recipes that you used to put together? What and and what uh what restaurants and this is pre COVID. That you used to rock out mm -hmm. with. Right, right, right. Uh I went this is here in Atlanta. Uh I went to Port on Blue there. I went from there to MGR, which that's the uh the Georgia Dome, now the uh Mercedes Benz Stadium. It was a Georgia Dome. Oh wait, wait, uh, wait, wait, Ken. We, we we talking about in the ATL. So you you didn't. So are you originally from Ohio? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. eighteen years. Oh, okay. So so you went down to ATL Atlanta. Atlanta. Yeah, no, it's eighteen. Oh, okay. So you went down to it. Okay, okay. We I, I'm good to go. I'm good to go. All right. So you went yeah. down to Atlanta, and you stayed mm -hmm. there, and that's where you got your. That that's where you got your culinary arts degree or whatever right. you want to call it. Yep. Concentration can't uh uh, uh, uh culinary arts concentration. Oh, it's uh mm -hmm. it's the art of science and the uh concentration was uh culinary. Okay. Okay. So so you so down in Atlanta you you was you was rocking out down in Atlanta. Uh, for the food and shit, right? Yeah, yeah. For uh, shit, shit, I was what twenty three, twenty four. Okay, okay. What was kind of uh, what was the, again? What what was what was the uh, what was the stuff that you was putting together? Okay, you know, what I'm saying uh, I was doing it uh, cordon bleu. Mm -hmm. Uh, chicken. Mm -hmm. Uh, I was doing uh, um, gator tail. Right. Uh, I was doing uh, bombay. Uh, frittatas. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then uh, you had like a you know saying some some sports you know stock. Um. The chicken, the chicken dish too. That was, you know, it was all uh, 
tasting good and everything else and all that. I forgot the name of it. But it was another, uh, but that was baked chicken right there that I did. So you, uh, so you, so you brought your art, your, 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 your chef up to, mm -hmm. back, back to Ohio. Where, where was you rocking right. out while you was in Ohio? All right. I was, this is from, from doing that. I went, I think I went back. I really didn't. I went, uh, I went to the uh, Waffle House for like six years. Waffle House? Dude, you yeah. wait, 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 Kenny, man, you you didn't waste your yeah. talents at the Waffle House, did you? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Damn it, man. Yeah, because all reason, reason, the beans, right there, I did that right there, because man, it was just like I had sauces all on me. You know what I'm saying? I came home right. and feeling like you know something real yummy. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, and I was like every day. So I was just like, man, if I could just get get a gig, I don't have to be so messy. Mm -hmm. You know, it can be clean, you know what I'm saying, and then, you know what I'm saying, still rock my shit, you know, I'll be all good. A person at, at the Waffle House game? Yeah. yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know that was a bad choice. That was a real bad choice. All right, so but, you know what I'm saying? the money was great, all that right there. It was all right. I mean, the money was I ain't, I ain't take a, a, a pay cut. Okay. So from so from from grilling at the at the Waffle House, you you decided to get into trucking. Where where, where did yep. where did that come from? Um, I mean I've been wanting to do uh drive trucks man since I was a little kid. I was like six. You know, I'm driving around. Well, I'm just. Walking down the main street, I see a car, uh, a truck go down. You know, I do it for the uh, for the uh, air horn, and every time I did it, you know, what I'm saying, I get that uh, response. So I was like, man. Oh, so you was, was like, so you was one of them kids with the with the with the with the motion, the arm motion. Yeah, the arm motion. I got the tougher truck. You know, what I'm saying and everything is right there. I had some my uh uh uh, 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 uh toys. From, from that point on. Okay. Now you know okay. there's some so was, you, you know there's some Joe Schmo on TikTok right now talking that garbage, talking about if you do the arm motion and 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 the truck drivers uh don't blow their horns because they can get in trouble. Have you have you heard of any type of shit like that? No, I never heard. Of it. Well, wait a hold on. Yeah, one time I did, but I didn't care. <laughs> and, you, know, uh, you know that that's what kids, that's, you know what that's for a kid. That's, that's what we do. You know what I'm, hey, I'm, all, I'm gonna do it for the kids, man. Right. The kids, you know what I'm saying? No, nah, and, and, and some of these four wheelers, four wheelers too. They can't drive either. <laughs> I mean, you know, they, I mean, for the kids, man, you know, they they get the arm motion. Of course, we're going to give the, you know what I'm saying, and 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 you and you see the 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 how how bright they eyes get when when we do it and all like that, and they be all happy and yeah. shit. They turn to their parents, yeah. They turn to their parents, yeah. And we got and we got this Joe Schmo out of nowhere on TikTok talking about. Oh well, you know why you know why they don't do it no more because you because they'll get a ticket, bro. Yeah, right. Well, yeah, well, right. Well, yeah. Where you come from? You know, I right, yeah. so so you you know me and you met up at a uh, Tri C Trucking Academy. Have you have mm -hmm. you have you you know I know you in Atlanta right now, but before you moved, did you did you go back to the academy and 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 see the new building and everything? Oh, you know what? No, I didn't. Wait a minute, no, no, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't even know where. You know what I'm saying? Like where, where it was actually. But I went to the old building. I, I Man, ain't nobody that, in there. Was, <laughs> that old building was like something out of motherfucking Michael Myers shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, especially at night, boy. Cause nothing in there. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it was like 
I don't know, man. We we when we went there, man, it was like a ghost town. Like it was a it was the building that we was in, was it it was actually abandoned, wasn't it? No, no, it wasn't. No, no, it wasn't. Uh they they had some uh some uh, some, uh offices in there, but mm-hmm. they did it in the morning. You know what I mean? Because when we came to school, it was like six. You know what I'm saying? We, we did it from what like from uh, yeah, we, we we rocked out from no, we did we did longer than that. We rocked out from like six to like eleven, didn't we? I know it was longer than that, yeah. man. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have it was you, from, yeah, from uh, six. No, actually, it was from from six to twelve. But oh, then, but, but we got off at eleven. Okay, okay, yeah, that was up. That's what's up. All right, so you know we in the school, we learning and everything. The the equipment there was kind of was kind of crappy. Trash, <laughs> yeah, trash. You said it was trash. trash. Now they got new stuff, huh? Oh yeah, oh yeah, they got, they got new stuff, yeah, they got they got <laughs> yeah, they got some uh, they got some they got yeah, they got they got uh, yeah, they got brand new equipment there. Hold on, right quick. Myself up. Right. Right. All right, all right. So yeah, they got they got some new uh yeah, they got some new equipment there now, man. New new freight liners and all like that. But when we was when we was training, that motherfucking red truck was horrible. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, that red oh, yeah. truck was horrible, man. But we, you know, we 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 made Ooh. it through well. We we gonna get to the part of what happened of you not making it through, but you know we 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 got it we we got it though. So have you have you still keep it? Do you still keep in contact with some of the guys there? No, yeah. no, I don't need. I don't, I don't talk. To, uh, put them back. I don't have that many. Um, it, yeah, I don't, I don't talk. To, talk to, uh, Eric. Mm-hmm. Um. Was it, uh, Brian? Yeah, you can get you, you, you those. Um, yeah, I don't talk to Brian. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't talk to uh, Cowboy. Oh, uh, I forgot all about Cowboy, Mister Mister. I know how to drive a truck, grinding gears all the way up and down yeah. Euclid Avenue. Yeah, yeah. I know how to drive a truck in the gears the whole way around. If I had to say he from my truck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so so what happened? What what happened, man? Why why you didn't make it through uh make it through Tri C and you had to end up going to Swift? Um I went to Tri C right there. I, I was doing good when I was over here. Um I guess they told me that I had too many backups. So I got it in a dang on uh in uh parallel. Mm-hmm. You know, that was the last that was the last joint. Right there, so so I just, so they, they told me I had to you know saying I had too many backups you know we're gonna come back you don't got to pay you know what I'm saying uh, I mean it's like sixty five and at that point and at that point in time I was not working I fun, so I was like, you know I want to be you know what I'm saying these pills but you know what I'm saying how can I how can I go back about asking me money for for any months. So I hope that's that's why I went to uh Swift. It, 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 it actually Swift called me and they told me, you know, that I know you were with uh Tri C but you but you can finish here mm-hmm. um you know with no, no no cost to you. You know, and I just see that's all you gotta do is just be the, uh, the parallel, and you can uh, drive, and then you know you have your uh, your uh, your uh, TDL. All right, so, so I thought about it. So so hold up, yeah. right quick. So during the tri C day, I mean during the tri C time, they were saying that you 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 kept flunking the 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 test the um. The actual, the actual CDL test when you go and get your license, you kept flunking that. 
No, 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 no. I did. I did that part. I did that. You know what I'm saying? The crim uh the uh the, the uh general knowledge, the, uh air brakes and the, uh No 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 I'm I'm talking about after every when we went to go and test out for our CDL. That that part you didn't pass, you didn't you yeah, didn't that 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 part because I was doing the uh the uh parallel and lady told me I had I had too many uh pull ups. Uh, pull ups. Okay. So you went back. Yeah. So you went back to Tri C and told them about it, and Tri C told told you that because when they told me, they only told me that we only had like like two times. If we flunked the first time, then they'll cover the second time. But you went back mm -hmm. and you you what you do? You went back and flunked both times, and that's when no what time? Nope, one time? Oh, it was one time, and then they told you you had to go. I mean, and then they had to charge you. Yeah. Oh my God. What? Yeah. So Tri C was Tri C was going to charge you for the second time? No. Um. Who the, the name of that keep uh place that we went to the, the uh to do the uh you know road test? Okay, they was going to charge you. They they told me that I, I that they were going to charge me uh some money. It was like. Five hours, me to come up and do it again. And I told him, I said, yeah, I came from you know saying try hold to on, see. You, so hold on, you oh, you no, you, you breaking time, Mike. I mean, uh, Ken, you you breaking up a little. You breaking up a little bit, bro. All right, give me a mic check when you get good. Hello, mic check, mic check. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I can hear you now. All right. Go ahead. What you was saying about it? It was Atlas. So what you was saying about Atlas? Yeah. Um, so, tell, telling you that they Atlas, had to charge you. Yeah, that they're gonna charge me if I come back in again. I have to come up sixty five dollars before I've been you know what I'm saying keep it before I've been you know what I'm saying uh finish out. Wow. I told them, I was like, well, I'm from Tri C, so no, 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 I'm not gonna do it one time. That's it. Wow. I mean, it, when I when they told me, they they told me we it was two times. If we if we fail the first time, you know, if we fail the first time, then uh Tri C would give us another time, and then after that, it will be sixty five dollars a watt. Mm -hmm. So you you said bump it, went to Swift, got your yeah. obviously you got your license with Swift. Mm -hmm. So what mm -hmm. uh, so what went down with Swift because you you rocked out at a couple of places before you before you got into haircutting. Yeah. So what? So what happened? So what was your experience at Swift and 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 a couple of other companies? And Swift, uh, for company side, it's like a crap, man. <laughs> they just, you know, what I'm saying first, first off, of course, the day on truck or slow as shit. Uh, and then um. Uh, and they just, they, I was telling them, and they don't listen to the drivers. The, the DN don't listen to the drivers at all. If you tell them, hey, I did not go to New York, Connecticut, Hampshire, Maine, all up in there, they still going to put you up in there. Mm -hmm. After you done told them, no, I'm not going to go to there. New Jersey, New York City, New York, you know, so all up in there. They, they still going to, uh, they're gonna still put you in there. And, uh, and when I let I left Swift because of that reason, uh, I went to US Express. Okay, okay, you came to my hood. Okay, okay. so I went. I went to uh, US Express. Uh, I was there for about two months. That was quick. 
Yeah, but then yes, I went to their sister company. They're also okay. called Swift. They're called Swift uh, Enterprise. Okay. And I went there and I rocked out there for like two, like a year and a half. Okay. Okay. So they, you know, they were good. It was just, just something same, same similar to a, um, a uh, owner operator. Mm-hmm. But it's a company. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I had the 20, uh, the, uh, the, uh, 20, uh, 17 uh, T680. You know, good, great, great equipment, man. They, 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 they equipment is top notch. I think they got the, uh, the Peter Belt now. Last right. time I heard. Bye, yeah. All right. So, so from, so you, you did a couple of companies. You, you, you rocked out at Swift, you rocked out at uh, US Express. Uh, the sister company. You also did uh, uh, PTL. Uh, PTL and uh, Hogan. So you yeah. you was just a you you was just a truck bouncing ass truck driver back in the day, huh? Yeah, because you know what I'm saying it would would just like they always say if the wife understand about your uh, career mm-hmm. and what, what are you doing. You're cool, but if she don't understand it, don't have some issues. All right. And that was my thing. That was my thing. I was having issues because she didn't like my wife didn't like how I was leaving out and how long I was uh staying out for. Well, what was how long how long on average you, you would stay out? Three weeks. Three weeks? And she couldn't handle yeah. that? No. Nah. Three weeks? She couldn't handle that, bro? No. Nah, uh, Your wife could not handle you being away for three weeks? At, at Now, this is what? Three weeks at a time? Yeah. Yeah. So, but every, how, how, every, long was your, how, how, how long was your home time? Oh, uh, it was about three days. Yeah. That, yeah, that, that would probably put a... Yeah. That that will probably yeah. pull a strain. You you gone for three weeks and only home for three or for three, three days. days. Yeah, <laughs> three weeks out of the month and only home mm-hmm. for three days out of the month. Yeah, yeah right. that that might put a strain. So she's uh she's putting the issues on you to get out of the industry. Uh, right, do do local. So you 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 did local? Well, if you did local, how did that work out? What did did that work oh, out was, a little bit better? Yeah, that was great. I was home every day. Okay. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I ain't had no issue. Oh, okay, okay. So she was okay, good. So was, she was good was with you being home. Yeah, was good. She right. she was good with you being home on local. Mm-hmm. Okay, so. Where did the where 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 did moving down to Atlanta come into play? What happened was um, she got a job here. Did she just have a, a transfer from a job in Ohio? Mm-hmm. And so she came. So and, and she was trying to get. The same, the same spot here in, in Atlanta. Okay. So she got it. You know and so she got the job, and then we moved. All right. So uh, did so nah, the company, the, the company was was that you was rocking out local. Was that like a mega carrier, or was that like a local company? No, it was uh U.S. Food. Oh, it was U.S. Foods. Yeah. Boy, Why crazy. you couldn't? What did you did you did you see if you can get the transfer down to Atlanta for U.S. football? Well, well, well no, they that 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 came with a uh, dilemma. So I left there. Actually, no, I got fired. There. Sorry, <laughs> first job ever got fired at it was U.S. Food. You actually got fired from a job, bro. 
Yeah, finally. What happened? Why, 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 why did they let you go? What happened? Man, I, I'm at this, uh, this um, hospital in Akron. Okay. Uh, so I was doing the delivery, and I was walking down this, this long corridor. Well, I see this, you know, they, they, they have like, like these metal uh, uh, fixtures that's on the wall. Mm -hmm. So I was, you know, I was, I wasn't even pushing it. I was pulling, I was pulling this, this, uh, this, uh, load. So I'm just walking, I have my, you know, my head on, uh, my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, music on. Mm -hmm. And then I looked over, I was like, so I see this, you know, this, this fucking beam hanging off the wall. So I was like, damn, somebody jacked this up. So I'm just going to just, you know, put this back right there. So, you, you know, it ain't me. So I put that thing back, came, I, I finished my, uh, my uh, shit. Right. Two days later, they sent me to the uh, office. And it's like, hey, did you hit something? I said, hit what? Well, you said you went to the hospital and you um um hit uh, um that you that you hit a wall. I was like, man, how can I wait, 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 Okay, and I was pulling, uh, and I was pulling the uh the crate. Okay, okay. So while I was pulling it, I looked over to my left, and I seen that this get this this metal. I I, I wouldn't even say it was a uh, foyer, but it was hanging off the wall. So all I did was I just put the damn thing back. You know, so so I, the only thing was I did was I uh, straightened it up, put it back up, straightened it up. Mm -hmm. And then I and then I can uh, and then I continue on with my uh, you know, with my uh, delivery. With your delivery, okay. Yeah, but then it's like two days later. Uh, my supervisor came uh, from me to the office and see if I hit anything. I told him, no, I ain't hit anything. Right. He was like, well, the security guards say that you hit something. I say, no, dude, I didn't hit shit. I said, I'm a truck driver. How the hell will hit something? You know what I'm saying? So if I can't, if I can't control this damn dolly, mm -hmm. how do you think I'm going to, you know what I'm saying, be able to uh, control a dang on the truck? So it was like, well, it's 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 on video saying that you did it. This and that. I said, well, can I see the video? No, we can't see. It. No, you can't see it. I said, no, man, you are accused me of something. I need to see it. Right. I I need to oh, see no, the no. I I need to see the evidence that you guys right. got against me. What the fuck? Right. So dude was like, no, no, no. Just uh, put your bag down. Uh, just. Give me your badge, and uh, you can call his dad. You, 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 you can go, go uh, you can, uh, come home. Daddy. I was like, and this is about a mother, uh, you know, because I was cussing him right there, and, and I threw everything at him. Mm -hmm. And, you know, so I was just like, so what should we do with the uh, you know, uniform? I was like, you know, he said, hey, you can keep it. I said, no, I'm going to throw it away. What the fuck I need to keep the uniform for? Yeah. <laughs> you know, so I threw the damn thing away. And then, yeah. then from there, um, then from there I left them and I went to uh, KSS Carter. No. Put it down. I went to uh, uh, KSS Carter. All right. So wait a minute, though. So, I mean, back to U.S. is I mean, not nah. Back to U.S. Foods. This is the, you, you was just walking down a corridor with the with the with the with the food cart or whatever, 
and they claim that you hit that you hit that you hit a wall with the food cart. Yeah, not the truck. No, I'm going down the cold corridor, man. I'm in the building. <laughs> and they I'm in they, the building. they let they. Ken, man, I'm I'm finding this kind of kind of fugazi right here, bro. You Stop. they yeah, they they let you they let you go because you ran into the wall with the food cart. Per se. What? I said per se. Per se. That you ran that, that you ran into a wall. A wall. Mm -hmm. With the pallet of food. With the pallet of food. <laughs> of food. And they let and they let you go for that. Yes. Uh huh. Bro. Oh, somebody if someone else's uh uh what's the name? So so okay, so wow. I'm Bro, I'm 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 flabbergasted to hear that they let you go for something that trivial, bro. I mean, did you did you tear shit up? No, I ain't tear nothing. So you you ain't tear nothing up. You you just they got it on video that they refused to show you that you mm -hmm. ran into the wall. I I can understand mm -hmm. if if you ran into something in the truck. That's why I'm still trying to understand. Yeah, are, are, you to, are you trying to are you trying to are you trying to gaze it <laughs> that you that you didn't run into anything? You ran into the wall with the pallet. No, I didn't. Wow. No, I didn't. Because I was pulling it the whole time. Oh, okay, okay. So and you as and, 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 and I did that. Um and I and I kept you no know, since soon as soon as I seen that, mm -hmm. and I kept uh pulling it. But U.S. But U.S. Foods, uh, U.S. Foods, uh, is 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 driver assist, right? You you had to you you had to unload and load and all that other good stuff. How much you was? How much you was? How much you was getting? Like, how how much you was unload. getting with them? Um, I was getting twenty two dollars an hour. Oh, they ain't, they ain't, they ain't, they ain't send my bad. Yeah. You know, oh man, look, I was, my, my damn check, my, my, my first one was like eighteen hundred. Okay. And then my, and then my second one was uh twenty, twenty three. Mm -hmm. And then the very last one, that sucker was twenty five. Oh. <laughs> Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, so, so you, you, make, you, 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 you can make some money, boy. Uh, you, you was food. But you, but but they let you go because you ran into a, you, you quote unquote ran into a wall and they just let you go like that, bro? Yeah. All right, man. So fast forward, so fast forward down at, uh, down, down in Atlanta. Did you did you get your did you get your barber's license in Atlanta or you got it in Ohio? Mm -mm, in Atlanta, my fact, I just got it. All right, so where where did haircutting coming into play, bro? <laughs> man, I've been I've been cutting man for since I was fourteen years old. God, and man, you've been well, came, let me let me get this straight. Came, oh, hold up, very quick. You you've been wanting to you you've been wanting to fuck with trucks since you was fourteen years old, and you wanted to no, cut no, hair at the same time. Right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this yeah. Is... Multitasking, bro. Multitasking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's called multitasking. <laughs> you know what I mean? So you want yeah. <laughs> so at the age of six is trucks. At the age right. of fourteen, is hair cutting. What, what was that? What was right. the hair for the for the for the shelf? Um, that happened when when I was my my, my from from seven when I got seventeen. <laughs> yeah, oh, so a jack of all trades, dude. You know, they'll just yeah, they'll they'll just they'll be telling me straight up.
Hey, don't don't stop that. Oh my god. All right, so you got so you got your uh you you got your barber license in Ohio mm-hmm. or in Atlanta. And right. uh and you just rocked out ever since then. Now now you just opened up a shop, right? Um uh, no, I actually um I, I'm I'm bringing the boot here at the uh at the shop. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I've seen I I seen your yeah I seen your IG and I I thought you opened up a shop. Oh no no. So how you know being a barber man you know how how do you in 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 the time of COVID and everything man how do you generate your customers? Uh, by uh social media. And uh, passing out, you know, passing out cards and everything, but it's mainly uh, social media. Okay, okay, that's what's up. So you got, so you got a nice little, you got a nice little clientele that 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 follows you, or or what? Uh, um, as far as uh, yeah, yeah, I got some people that uh that, uh, that follow me. Mm-hmm. Got some uh. Some some old barbers that uh that uh does the same thing. Okay, that's what's up, man. That's what's up. All right, man. Well, Ken, man, thank you very much for coming on, bro, and uh sharing your experience from 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 chef to truck driver to barber. You still got your CDLs though? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I mean, is there going to be a time yes. that you're going to come back, come come back to it, or you just you just gonna you you just gonna just hold on to it for whatever you need it? Yeah, I'm gonna just rock. Yeah, I'm gonna just just rock them and just, 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 just hold them until I'm about to ready to go back. Yeah. <laughs> so there, so there, there might be a time of you coming back though. Yeah. Okay, that's what's up, man. Well, I hope the I hope to see you soon. You know what I'm saying? But yo, you, right. would yo, if you come back into it, would you still have to go and try and find a local gear? Because down in Atlanta, man, that motherfucking traffic ain't no damn joke, bro. Uh, no, I uh, know. Anything, if I rather go go back and do it, I I'll probably do it uh over the road. You uh, you you think your you think your wife will be all right with it this time around? It, she, she, yeah, she, she told me a, a couple times that you know I'll be good, you know this time. Cause this this time around. Son was, yeah, yeah, but son, he was like four. Uh, yeah, I hear your kid in the background. How old is he now? So, he eight. Oh, okay. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. All right, Ken. Well, I'll let you get back to it, man. Thanks for coming on and sharing, right quick. Definitely right. got the number, and you know we're on Facebook and all that other good stuff, man. Uh, let everybody know where you at if they down in Atlanta and they need a cut. All right, need a cut. Back here in Atlanta, I'm at six two zero one Memorial Drive, Stone Mountain. All right, all right. So if you need that fresh cut, my man Kenny. Kenny the barber, Kenny the trucker, Kenny the chef, <laughs> man of all, jack of all trades. If you need that cut, he's right there for you guys. All right, Ken, I'll holler at you later, bro. There's something in the air tonight. Got a feeling coming over me. I sweat that this is that place to be in the water, in the, the water.